Hello Pisces, this is Chelsea. Today we are going to see what love has in store for you in the future. And this is a timeless positive reading. Spirits and angels, please show me love for Pisces. Six of Cups in reverse. Hmm. Somebody from your past. Bad memories in regards to someone from your past. Got the Page of Wands here. Perhaps communication. Hmm. Past communication. I see more. Got the Ten of Cups. Happily ever after. Also can indicate family commitment. The lovers is here. Indicates a choice. Physical intimacy. Or an actual lover. Let's see more. Two of Swords. Again, you've got a choice between two person perhaps or it could indicate block communication feeling split into two got these seven of pentacles here waiting somebody could be waiting for somebody to send a message please show me more ten of pentacles awesome we got two tens here perhaps you have a choice between two person in the future okay nine of pentacles Independence, self-sufficient, single. Oh. We've got the ten. Uh, sorry, Will of Fortune here. Luck is gonna be on your side. Things are gonna change for the better. Okay. Nine of Swords. Perhaps a lot of stress thinking about a choice that you need to make. And we've got the Page of Pentacles and offer. A very small offer, but it is solid. But well, let's um, pull out a few oracles, Pisces. Worth waiting for. See, you're waiting for something. Seven of Pentacles. Spirit saying that it's worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work at your love life. Wish you me more. Very soon. So whatever you've been waiting for, it's going to happen very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. It means you need to set your intention and manifest it too, okay? Children. Your love life is being affected by children. Or oh, some of you, maybe it's pregnancy. Some of you, maybe, yeah, you have children. Pay attention to the red flags. I feel like this is somebody from your past. Let your friends help you. Ask for and accept support from others. All right, Pisces. So it does look like, because we got the Ten of Cups and Ten of Pentacles, perhaps a lot of you could either be thinking about um, having a family, having children, or for some of you, you actually do have children, okay? Or a child. But what I'm sensing here is there will be uh, a choice between two person. Perhaps for some of you, if you are single and you're looking for somebody new, you may have a choice between two person. You're going to be very stressed out in regards to who you should choose in the end, okay? But again, I do sense two swords can also indicate a block communication. For some of you, maybe there is no communication between you and somebody from your past. It looks like uh, very soon, Spirit saying that the communication is going to open, okay? But also you need to pay attention to the red flags. If somebody with the page of one sitting here, six of cups in reverse, is, if this is someone from your past, if they return, make sure they're not returning just for to be physical intimate with you, with the lovers here, okay? Because this is what you want. You want the ten of pentacles. You want the long-term um connection forever commitment children even family uh, building a legacy together and you want to be happy as well ten of cups here this is what you want and you just hope for the nine of pentacles here um i feel like you just hope that you can be okay being alone for now but but also it could mean fearful that you're going to be alone forever for some of you, you may have fear that you're going to end up being alone. 
Um, but Nine of Pentacles is a good card for me. I feel like that means you're very attractive and you have your options again with the lovers and the two swords. Perhaps you have you you get to choose, okay? And we've got the Wheel of Fortune here. This is definitely I feel like Spirit is saying this is sitting in an advice position. Spirit is definitely telling you to change something here, okay? Change the direction or change your type. For some of you, maybe it's the type of people, the type of partner that you would usually go for. Perhaps it's time to change to a, you know, different type of partner. <laughs> Hope that makes sense to you. But the Wheel of Fortune is a really good card. It does indicate um, there will be changes for sure, but changes that are good for you, okay? Changes that are very positive. But there'll be a lot of stress here with the Nine of Swords. Perhaps, you know, you may have to choose you may have to choose for some of you it is a choose is it, it is a choice between to be with this person or to uh choose other things okay it may not be choosing between two person it could mean choose between being with that person or work or anything anything else relocation for some of you okay but it does look like with the page of pentacles here um pisces it looks like um, there'll be an offer, okay? This person can be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. But some of you may be hoping for somebody whom is very independent and self-sufficient or somebody whom can be, whom can give you what you want, which is stability and loyalty. But if you've been waiting for a message for somebody from somebody, it's going to happen soon, okay? Uh, with the Page of Pentacles. And Spirit says that if you're waiting for your soulmate, if you're single, you've been waiting for... Uh, a new love it looks like it's gonna happen very soon but you're gonna be plagued by you know um, some confusion i feel or some stress and anxiety in regards of a choice that you need to make okay between maybe again somebody two person or a choice between to be with this person or not so there could have been somebody i feel uh in the past who may have given you some bad memories okay Someone of a fire sign here, um, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Perhaps you could have blocked communication or that they don't want to talk to you or you don't want to talk to them right now. But it does look like um, this could be the pay attention to red flags because there is somebody, okay, Pisces, who may just, um, maybe from your past, I feel, there is somebody who may just, you know, because the page of wands is somebody who doesn't quite stick for a stay for a long time okay they they come and go they come and go it's there's no stability here you may be very be very happy to be with them but it seems kind of temporary okay so this is something you need to make sure that they just not back or be to be with you for good times okay only for the good times. so but it looks like spirit's definitely telling you that very soon someone whom is going to make you really happy and give you the ten of pentacles uh, commitment, loyalty, and you know, building a legacy together. And for some of you, maybe this uh, this person may not be living around your same area, or that they have a different background. Or maybe you meet this person while you are traveling. Okay. All right, Pisces. This is your reading. I hope uh, you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm gonna leave you with a few videos on screen. If you guys would like to. Uh, choose to watch any of those videos next feel free to if not pisces i hope to see you tomorrow at your next reading take care bye